four years starving in New York, doing showcases I had to pay for myself. This was my first big break. My first feature, like the zero budget movie about people who were taken up in alien spaceships and given physicals against their will. I go in for the audition and the director's really intense and mysterious. And he has me sit with my eyes closed and free associate, right? We do these improvs about the aliens representing our most primal fears and it's great. Finally, some real acting. And they tell me before I leave that I got the part. Only, I don't know what it is yet. But I'm so thrilled because it's this feature, you know? It's not a student film or anything. So the agent gives me a script and I go looking for it. I go looking for Tony, the part that they say I have. And I got my yellow underline marker in my hand. Only it's drying out. And finally, I find only one page with a corner folded over and I'm in this therapy group with these people who have these alien physicals and I've got only one line. I didn't ask for the anal probe. But I'm a professional, right? I'm prepared. I backstory this person. I knew that they had been in to get their hair cut before they came to the therapy group. I knew that they turned the TV set on the minute they got back to the apartment just for the sound of it. And I even had my girlfriend, my girlfriend at the time, with a thermometer, you know, uh, for the sense memory. So finally, comes time to shoot the scene. By the time they get me, the crew's grumpy because it's late and they're non-union. They don't get paid extra for overtime. The lead actor's gone, he's got his shrink appointment, and I'm alone. And I'm staring at this piece of tape stuck to the camera. And the director says, okay, let's try it a few times without cutting it up. Show me a few different colors. I didn't ask for the anal probe. 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 That was it.